Hello and welcome back. If you are new to this channel, my name is Marie. Today, I want to show you how to make a pineapple cheesecake in just under 45 minutes. And there's no baking necessary. This cake is designed to look elegant and enticing. It tastes refreshingly fruity and creamy. You are going to like this quick, simple recipe. The whole thing takes just three basic steps. A cake base, the filling, and the topping. So we begin by making a base for the cake. For that, we'll use five ounces of graham crackers and four ounces of butter. Put the crackers in a plastic bag and break them up into smaller pieces. Then, cross them with a rolling pin. You could also use a food processor for this step. Either way works. Once they're crushed, transfer them to a mixing bowl. Pour in the melted butter. Mix until the two ingredients are well combined. It's best to use a cake pan with a detachable bottom. That makes removing the cake easier later. Pour in the crumb mixture, then level and compact it to an even thickness. Press with any flat bottom object. I'm using a drinking glass. Now set this aside until we are ready for it. Step 2 is to prepare the cake filling. Let's look first at the ingredients and I'll show you how to make it. Here we have crushed pineapple, heavy cream, sweetened condensed milk, cream cheese, gelatin, vanilla bean paste, and salt. The salt helps brighten the sweetness, so be sure to include it. We'll start by preparing a whipping cream. Whip the heavy cream for 2 minutes until it becomes light and fluffy. Set it aside for now. Next, squeeze the juice out of the pineapple. You could use fresh pineapple, but can works fine in this recipe. Get as much of the liquid out as possible, so the cake won't become soggy. Set the pineapple aside. Now, strain the juice to get a clear liquid. We'll use it in the filling as well as later in the topping. Mix 3 tablespoons of the juice with 1 package of gelatin, which is a quarter ounce. Since this is a no-bake recipe, we'll use gelatin to give the cake a firmer texture. Mix to dissolve and then let it sit for 3 to 5 minutes. If you are not ready to use it right away, Set it in a pan of hot water to keep it from hardening. In a separate mixing bowl, pour in the cream cheese, sweetened condensed milk, vanilla bean paste, and salt. Whip the mixture until it's creamy. Now, strain in the gelatin mixture, followed by the whipped cream. Mix it again until all the lumps are gone. Last comes the pineapple. Fold it in gently. Finally, pour the filling over the crust. Shake the pan gently so the filling spread evenly. Set it aside in the fridge for now while we move on to the third and final step, which is to prepare the topping. Here we have 3 quarter cup of juice. Add half a package, which is 1 8 ounce of gelatin. 
Mix well and let it bloom for three to five minutes. Then put the gelatin in a pan of hot water to keep it liquid while we prepare the other ingredient. I'll add these pineapple slices to the topping. Lay them on paper towels to absorb excess liquid. We are ready to garnish the cake. Spoon on some gelatin first so the slices adhere better. Arrange them according to any desire you like. Now add more jello to cover them and level the top. And that's it! Now we just need to let it chill overnight in the fridge. This cake has been set in the fridge overnight. To remove the cake from the pan, closely wrap a hot kitchen towel around it for about 10 seconds to loosen it. It should slice out easily now. There you go. There you have it. A refreshingly fruity and creamy pineapple cheesecake. Enjoy. Thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, remember to like, share, and subscribe.